Okay, so my uh, I was able to successfully connect to my Wi-Fi network. Uh, at this point, I can go ahead and hit the back key to go back to the first time setup. Now it's testing my Wi-Fi and connection was good. Also, the connection to the download server was okay. So the next screen, I can check for a software update. Um, one thing I wanted to point out, uh, you can use the left and right arrow keys on the remote to navigate the menu on the bottom here. And at any point, you can skip a step if you don't want to, you know, for example, if you don't want to do a software update check, you can go ahead and skip and go to the next step. Or if uh, you need to change something, you can use the go back. For example, if you want to use a, choose a different Wi-Fi network, uh, if you want to use wireless instead of wired or wired instead of wireless, you can come back here and change your selection. Uh, in fact, you can go back all the way to the beginning if you wanted to. And, uh, you know, start all over again. So let's go ahead and skip date and time since we already done that. Skip uh, the internet connection. And let's go ahead and check for a software update. So there is a software update available for my Zapper box. There is a good chance, um, well, there is a chance, I'm not sure how good of a chance it is, that when you get to Zapper box, uh, there might be an update available for you. I know Zapper box has uh, a lot of adding new features continuously. Um, usually they have uh, one or two updates per month. So I would go ahead at this point and uh, install the update usually the update does not take uh, more than uh, a minute or two unless there is a okay so the update is complete my box is rebooting it came back up so let's go back to the previous screen so let's check for software update again. And you can see there's no update available. So the update was successful and I do have the latest update now. Um, so again, uh, at this point, we're ready to run a channel scan. Um, again, you could skip this if you wanted to, but if you do, once the box boots up, it will go into the channel scan screen because you, you cannot really do much uh, if you don't have any channels uh, in your channel map so going to go ahead and say continue run a channel